they tell you what the fuck you must know. The Pisces way, a place for a Pisces man just for a Pisces family and rising. And you already know it's your girl Hyper Sis Amar, and you already know how we do. So sit back and relax, and we definitely gonna get the tea for the Pisces. Clock watches are definitely welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay. So let's tap right in and let's smudge our space and do a quick prayer. I have power, I can just answer the signs and glasses of your mind, wise life. Please protect me and my family as we seek your previous needs. Please protect our energy from any unwanted souls, vibes, or entities. Please give us the clarity and the truth. Please surround us with your love and God us with your wisdom, always and forever. High power, our angels, answers of the divine white light, showing gratitude and thanks for all the blessings, the lessons, the seasons, and new beginnings. For you delivering us away from temptation, guiding us throughout our journey to the motherland of milk and honey. Forever grateful for your divine protection and love. Amen. Now, Let's go right in with it. So, I did want to see, like, what's the current energy? I do got the King of Wands out here, because that's where we left off at. But I feel like High Power is telling me to put him back in the deck. High Power is telling me, okay, well, keep him out. I should have put the King and the Queen. Whether you guys are together or not, I feel like I want to check up on the energy, these karmic energies. And we can just do it both here. Like, what is... Since high power, I'm getting out the download. The Empress came out here. Well, they were the Emperor and the Empress. But we're going to kind of leave off from where that last video was with the King and Queen of Wands. So I'm going to just take it like that. I feel like the energy is hot and heavy, okay? I feel like both of you guys could be a little bit sexually frustrated or something, like, with that hot and heavy, spicy energy is giving me. Spicy Pisces energy, okay? Okay. I'm hearing Taurus. Y'all could be dealing with a Taurus. Oh, you got Taurus highly aspect in your chart. That bull side of you is coming out. Maybe you could be a little impatient. Somebody's impatient here. Um, but let's see. What is this? Look. Eight of Cups. Okay. But let's see. So we want to know what is the next moves of the karmics, higher power? What is the um, karmics intentions here? What is their next moves? What are they plotting on? They plotting on this, okay? They plotting on this lover here. They plotting on the relationship. So for some of you guys, they could be trying to turn you guys against each other. Or make some, you know, not come together. If you guys are already in together, okay, somebody don't want a confession to be said. Or, okay, no way. Whether they don't want a confession to be said or they don't want something to be released about a confession, something to be um, enlightened, something to be coming out of the woodwork here. This is what this karmic don't want. They don't want somebody to say something, um, confess something, or reveal something that's going on. Yeah, my eyes keep going down on this lizard here. I feel like I'm here mimic. I feel like your divine feminine, if you're in the masculine here, they could be dealing with familiars, okay? For some of you guys, this karmic could be sacrificing animals, or they could be calling upon dope. They could be calling upon, um, yeah, we got high priestess here. Hold on. Hold on. Real quick. Something's being revealed about a high priestess or something's being said about somebody.
somebody's intuition. I'm hearing something's being enlightened here. For some of you guys, this high priestess is an auntie or an uncle. We got an emperor here. Okay, so we was getting that emperor in a verse in the last reading, but let's just see what it says. I feel like this could be a father figure, your father. Um, I'm hearing our father. Uh, what's the prayer? Our father art in heaven. Thou, I don't know, to kingdom come that shall be done on earth as it is in heaven. Please forgive us for this daily bread. Somebody could be praying daily. Or I don't feel like somebody here could go to church. So somebody's a hypocrite. I feel like these these um false prophets or false priests. It's something that they teaching. I'm hearing rec uh recommendancy. Okay, I'm saying it wrong. But I feel like somebody whatever the, it is that they're teaching here, yeah. They're lying about it. They also could be balancing some type of community. They could be getting a lot of backlash on something that they said or done. They balance that. Somebody is topsy turvy for these karmics at this time. They're trying to juggle some type of conflict along with some type of backlash that they could be getting from the community. They they could be getting from other people. You know how this could even just be people putting their opinions out and saying certain shit. They could be feeling some type of way about what people are saying and what's going on. Um, this could even be out in the terror community. Because I did, I was getting like, there's a lot of, um, you know, this don't have to just be in the terror community. Maybe this is in church. This could be at work. Something that they do here, they could be getting a, back, uh, a lot of backlash on it. You know, um, I'm also getting somebody could be in debt. Maybe they owe something here. What's the point of they juggling? But it's something that's getting out of control with this vote. I feel like they could be waiting or wishing that they could be rescued or helped here. But see how something's topsy-turvy? It's like the boat's going up and down, up and down. It's like I'm hearing the eye of the tiger. But you know what it's giving me? The eye of the sea. The eye of the sea. Um, Somebody could be a sailor or they like to go fishing or they like to travel by boat or something like that. But that's giving me the energy of this one movie I had seen where, you know, it was these men, these fishermen, they was told, it's like an older movie. I was watching it with my grandma. They was told not to. Okay, family, I'm back. Now, for some of you, now, for some of you, um, they are determined to break up something. But I feel like it could be something with other lovers that they could have. Maybe they got other lovers that's in on this shit too. That's cooperating with something here. Because with this nine of wands, that's determination. That's also feeling like, you know, I'm getting from this card. Somebody feel like they was defeated and they want revenge. You know, look how he looking with that bandage on his head. Like somebody done whooped his ass or something. And they, and he want revenge. You know, he got something to say. He want to say. Okay, he could have emotions, but he trying to act like he don't got no emotions. He trying to put them all behind him. He trying, there's somebody that's trying to act tough, but they really got some emotions. They really feel some type of way about this, this, um, now this could be, I don't know, shit. Let's find out though, because I don't know if y'all had a love situation, somebody, a cheating partner, one of you guys, um, cause we get that it's, okay, we get that it's a karma here. We get that it's an emperor here. We get that it's high priestess. But it, it could be somebody else that's like jealous or in the background that's mad about this. They Maybe they wanted something. They could have tried to break something up. They feel jealous. Maybe they don't have no love or they don't, they they not, they not won't be receiving a love or a twin flame or a high level soulmate. This could be somebody that's in some type of jealousy or envy. I'm telling you, look at his face. He mad. Like, yeah. He didn't built him a fort and shit. Like this could also be somebody that's determined to try to keep somebody out, shut somebody out of something, push somebody out of a wheel. That's what I just heard. Let's find out. I'm hearing how many licks does it take to get to the center of a tussie pop? One. Now, with this four of swords, 
This is giving me healing, okay? Healing something being put to rest. I'm here now, 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 lay me down to sleep. I feel like somebody's going to be able to rest with something, rest peace, peacefully. They won't have to worry at night about their investments, about their money, something being in the bank or something that they're growing. Something that they've been watching, though. I feel like somebody's been planting seeds and they've been watching it grow because they feel like it's been a lot of sneaky people around them. And they haven't, they forced to watch their shit at night. Like, you know, you got to look outside and make sure your car's still outside or something. Or you got to, you know, watch around your house and make sure, mo you know, protecting what's yours. But I also feel like somebody's going to be able to rest, okay? This is what I'm getting. Somebody ain't going to have to worry no more. Okay, I probably said go in with the shadow. Look, that red still right there. Go in with the shadow. With the shadow. So that means it's a lot of shit hidden underneath the under the underneath the surface. I, I'm hearing there's a lot of shit being left unsaid. That's what's going on. Some type of lie that's being told that's being exposed here. Hey, the source, some type of illusion that they put. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you something that they put out in the community that they said to the community or did to the community here. I feel I strongly get that because it's like it's a lot of people. Something that they were saying, like I feel like they was putting out false belief or false hope. Okay, because with this high priestess here, somebody could be like a tarot reader or something. Okay, entrepreneur, something that they lied about, something that they, you know, they probably was giving false hope to the people. Saying shit, but they, you know, they really didn't know what they were saying or what they were doing. It's something about being put into illusion. Something's being moved into karma waters. I feel like somebody refused to give in to this lie or work with this lie, like work with somebody who's been lying. Okay, no, okay. Somebody is refusing because the four pentacles is here. So somebody's being stingy, holding back. But I feel like somebody's also trying to hold back on they part on what they did with something or some type of lie or something that was being said here. Because I feel like somebody else is moving into karma waters and something's being looked phony. Like people start to look at something weird. Um... You know what I'm getting? I've been getting that a lot lately. Like, say for instance, somebody said that this was their divine counterpart. Maybe they should try to be like, to act like they was the queen of wands, and this was they king of wands, and this was they divine counterpart. But, like, they was, I'm hearing holy matrimony, like they was married, this they divine master, and they could have been preaching or saying this to other people, like, how to come into union with your master, and this and that. But then, motherfucker looking at them like, why you why y'all divorced it then? Ooh, ooh, nah, they looking at them like that ain't making sense. Where's your, some of y'all now? If they was in this business together or they was doing something together, like say for instance, if if they were like doing tarot videos together or profit videos or they was doing something together, and this master is separated, this master's moving to common waters. This master has left the fucking building. Okay, they can even be confessing to you about something that happened. Again, this is out in the community. Look at that, the community in the background. He holding out. He He's holding his knowledge, what it is that he know, he's keeping it to himself, and he's just moving into common waters. I feel like somebody's not trying to embarrass somebody or blow nothing up. They could be trying to move into common waters, you know, quietly and peacefully. They don't want no drama. 
I'm here. You don't want no drama, drama, woo. You don't want no drama with me. I don't know. I feel like they will be on that shit. For some of you guys, this masculine could be threatening this karmic. Like, you better chill out before I expose you or something. Because this person, they in their head. They in their head. Because all these lies they've been saying. All, it's, it's a lot of lies they've been saying. I'm hearing people can want their money back. All kind of shit. This could be a church. This could be something. But something, this is something. A lie is being exposed here. Somebody running out of money. They run. They could be running out of funds. I feel like this person. Now, for some of you guys, this karmic is going through a situation where they are running out of funds. Here, they could be losing money. Now, I don't know if you know this person has some intuition or something like. Say for instance, they do have some intuition, right? They could know some shit, but they weren't meant to be with this person that they said that they were meant to be with. They could have lied about sex, okay? Not saying that this person don't have some type of sort of intuition by them coming out as a high priestess. They probably know some shit, but they probably don't have a twin flame, a divine master. Not everybody does. So, they could have lied about that to try to sell some type of story, or to try to make something, you know, bring something to life or bring them, get them more views or get them more notoriety or something here. They could have even lied to this damn masculine. For some of y'all, they lied to this masculine. Because I feel like somebody, and I, I feel like it's somebody don't have enough funds to rebuild their life. Like, they could be owing people money. They could be going to court. All kind of shit. So, it's like, to pick up where they start. Like, you know how when you get a divorce or when you break up with somebody, you know, especially if y'all living together and stuff and going half on the bills and stuff, you know, shit starting to fall short when you can't pay your rent or when you can't, when you got to move out the house or when you ain't got that person to be helping you no more. Shit do fall short. I feel like they ain't got no money to rebuild their life here. Let me see something. Cause for some, look, the devil. Right there. Eight of Cups. Somebody walked away from the motherfucking devil. This emperor. Now. Hold on. Now for some of you. Let's see. Because I know we was getting the emperor reverse, but I ain't going to really too much rely off of that. Because for some of you, I feel like even an emperor, like say for instance, they was with an emperor. They decided to be in a relationship with an emperor. Um, and not your divine partner. Now, for some of you guys, this is your divine partner. But for some of you guys, there's some type of father figure. They could have walked away from this person. Or somebody's walking away from the devil. And this this father figure could be the devil. Let me see. Give me something on this eight of pentacles. But I'm getting um uh, I'm giving this for ends here. Can I get one or two seeds? Something for this eight of pentacles. No. I heard it all before. Somebody could be wanting somebody to invest or rebuild with them. They could be asking somebody for money. Are trying to start over. Now, for some of you guys, they trying to start over with this emperor. Okay. Now, your person could be coming out as this. Yeah, they could be trying to um kick it. You know, with this less chill movie night, wine and dine, smoke, DoorDash. They could be trying to come over to their house and 
and chill because they don't got no money. They running out of money or they don't got no funds to do something. Bad motherfucking mother. There we go. We, this is this person. Okay, let me see. Now, this person could be a cancer or something could be happening in July. This person could be a cancer. Look, organ, unorganized. This person is unorganized. They could be trying to do something by July. Okay, they deadline could be July. And they could be trying to do something by July, but I feel like something's unorganized. They running out of time here. Give me something on this emperor. What is the thing with this emperor? Nine of pentacles. Single and stable. I feel like... Some of y'all looking. It came out just like that. Y'all see me? I ain't moving shit around. The King of Wands is right here. The King of Wands is right there. You see that star down there? This this emperor here tried to do something to this. This emperor could be like a hitman, or this could be a father. Whether this is this 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 high priestess father, or so this could be your father or your divine master father. Or if you the divine feminine, so wherever you fit in the in the in the description, Pisces. Wherever you fit, take it however resonate me the rest. But this emperor here, they could have walked away from this high priestess, right? But with the nine of pentacles, they, they could be single and stable. Okay, they can have a little money. This emperor, I don't feel like they no broke person. They they got a little money, they move shit around. But for some of you all, uh, they finna die. There's gonna be a death here because they targeted this the this um they targeted this um this king of wands. Yeah. This king of wands was inspired. I feel like this king of wands is very intuitive as well. Like you could be some type of earth angel star seed here. And I feel like once you make like you know how when they say when you they the, the whole reason why most times the karmics try to be strategic by trying to confuse a motherfucker is because of judgment. Once you know and you aim that shit back to whoever been sending that energy towards you, or once you return that shit to sender, all that other shit, you know, once that energy go back and you know exactly who did what, when, where, why, that shit, you know what I'm saying, you know who exactly to send it to. And I feel like that's what this master could have did. They could have just been, you know, Return the sender, or it's something here. They, but you see that target behind him, though. They targeted this master. They did. Now, they could have did this for money. They could have did this so that they could be free of something. For some of you guys, this high priestess was, um, I'm hearing ransom note. For some of you guys, this high priestess was, um, they was blackmailing this emperor to do something. And they could have did something to try to be free from this high priestess. Like, I did that favor for you, now can you leave me the fuck alone, or something like that. But, I don't know, they could have just did this for money here. They could have did something to try to reap the benefits of it. Because with the nine of pentacles, they, they got the money, though. I feel, I'm, I'm hearing stole they sold to the devil. There's somebody who did some shit for some money, man. Look, page of swords. Defensive-ass energy. Give me something on this bitch. What's this here? This death. Now, death could also be an end. Like, this could also be an ending, but I'm getting a death here. I'm getting a Scorpio. This person could be a Scorpio, too. Or uh, you could have Scorpio in your chart, person, take out his neck. What is this death here, my child? What, what's this? I'm telling you. Look, Twin Flame. I seen Twin Flame fall out. So, for some of you guys, they did this to both of y'all. They did. They was trying to put an end to this connection here. 
Or they could have tried to put an end to both y'all lives to end out this connection. This could be something that's still going on too. Look, I see you in my dream. One of y'all had a vision. One of y'all had a vision about this motherfucker. You were in, it could be your mask in here, was inspired with that star. They were inspired by something that they seen in the dream. They could have seen this person coming or doing something. We got angelic assistance, 911. Archangels' ancestors had to step into this shit. Something went down on Mother's Day. Something happened on Mother's Day. Somebody could have uh, asked somebody out to eat, or somebody was trying to hurt somebody on Mother's Day. Because I keep hearing fine dining. This could have been, this emperor, for some of you guys, this emperor tried to ask this. Noel, you too loud. For some of you guys, this emperor tried to ask this queen of wands out to eat, and they was going to try to do something to this queen of wands. Okay? If you this queen of wands, they was going to try to do something to you. They was going to try to help you. Uh, I said help you. They was going to try to hurt you. But what I'm trying to say is angels help you. Uh, your intuition probably told you not to go or... For some of you guys, I don't know, but for some of you guys, they, they could have been trying to do something for this master, too. Now, I have been getting hitman as energy. It has been going, you know, I have been feeling that a little bit, but that did not come out here. King of Swords did not come. Wow. Thank you, High Powers. A confirmation every motherfucking time. Look. King of Swords. And they go to King of Wands right there with the lovers right behind me. I can't never make this shit up. I'm telling you. For some of y'all, they was jealous because they wanted, they want to be like your masculine. They want to be with your feminine. It's something that this, this masculine won't. I mean, it's something that this emperor wanted of this masculine. Now, for some of y'all, maybe it's the fact that I'm here. Maybe it's the fact when she said, baby, it's the fact that once it's gone, you never get it back. Hold on to your witnesses. You've your promises. You're worth waiting for. Be strong, honey. Don't give the blessed cause of patience. And we be looking. Okay, I can't even read really right now. My nose messed up. No, well, yeah, get out of here because you're making my noise. But... I feel like um, this emperor wanted to tempt, because I'm here, I need a tip drill. And I'm also here, temptress. They wanted to tip, they could have liked this. Okay, I did say that y'all could have some good sex. Y'all got some good, I'm hearing a good yoni. Some of y'all got some good yoni. I ain't going to lie, okay? And for some of y'all, y'all y'all masculine got some good wine. That's why they want, they want y'all to be together. But y'all see, y'all only can do this for each other. Now, they come out as an emperor because, I don't know if it was some type of soulmate connection. Maybe this person holds some type of authority. Like I said, they a father figure. They can even have money, whatever. But, because I'm getting like this emperor ain't no, they, they got money. But they very, very arrogant, though. But I feel like this person was trying to strategically break y'all up or not have y'all be together because... They like that yo the the feminist yoni box or they want some of what the feminine had. But I feel like they wanted the masculine wisdom or wealth. So they could have did this for money. Or like I said, they also was doing something for this high priestess for sexual favors. Okay. This was some I do feel like it was some type of blackmail involved in this situation. Noel, get out of here. You is too loud with that stick. That thing, whatever that is, put that down. That's the sister thing that's all I think. Go get me some tissue. I like that. You need something to do. Put on my mask. I'm gonna get a little bit throw back here. Hold on.
Well, the thing, see, that's why I said, well, she be making me look like a fuck, man. Um, this high priestess was doing some witchcraft, too. Yeah, I keep hearing, I'm gonna leave the door open. That song, door wide open. This could be somebody who, you know, they legs open, okay? They legs open for this this mask in here, this King of Wands. They know this King of Wands know how to do what they do. They know how to work it and stroke it. So for some of you guys, they they this this emperor is mad because this King of Wands can do what they do in the bedroom. For some of y'all, y'all could have rejected this emperor, right? Um, cause it, I can't help but notice, look at his thing is little, like his thing little, and then you know the King of Wands thing is big, so I don't know his, his pole, but that could be significant, like maybe, I, it, it could be something with the, you know, cause he the emperor, so you know the emperor, it's some of our ego and pride that got him mad, you know, because it's like, and this person could be older, Cause it's like, you know, he, he I'm here little ass nigga. I'm telling y'all, I'm telling somebody is jealous. I just heard little ass nigga. Like I'm telling you, somebody jealous is a bitch because I'ma tell you, like, you could have you could have denied this person because can't nobody do it how y'all do it. Like when y'all get together, this could just be based off of not just sexual energy, but it's like y'all are made for each other. Y'all are made for each other. But the thing is this emperor felt like he could come in with his money, his wealth. You know, he could even be a little older. But you see, he got the armor on under the cloak. He tried to hide the fact that he had some hidden. Now, remember we were talking about the armor in the first video. Having some hidden being guarded. Okay? He was guarded the whole time. He had some type of hidden agenda. Y'all, I'm getting so many downloads from this picture. Because look at his hand over there. That's an apple. You know, they're giving me Snow White. When the witch came, act like an old lady in need and gave Snow White that apple and put her to sleep, girl. For some of y'all, he tried to give y'all something to eat. He poisoned your food. Now, you could have came past this motherfucker. I feel like some didn't work, though. It didn't work. You was too strong or something. This person, this person put something in your food or something. They tried to give you something. But I feel like you could have rejected them in the end. Your intuition came forward. You could have left this person alone. And I feel like that's when this person became the emperor in reverse. Now, for some of y'all, your master could be seeing them as the emperor in reverse because... There was a friend or they associate or they buddy or something, but whole time they only became friends with them to plot on them. And they could have been messing with both them. This this mask is mad. I ain't gonna lie. Because look, King, this mask is mad, King of Wands, because for some of y'all, he feel like they mess with he messed with both his females. He messed with his high priestess and he messed with the King of Wands, the Queen of Wands. And you know what? You could be a high priestess too, but you you standing more in this passionate, beautiful, blossoming, sexual energy right now. I ain't gonna lie, y'all both sexual. I feel like both of y'all ain't been having no sex. Both of y'all been, you know, but y'all are passionate about each other. That's why you must be coming out as the king and queen of wands, because that's where your focus is directed at this time. That's where the energy is going. Now, we got a Queen of Pentacles over here. What is this? It's the Queen of Pentacles here. This uh, faces some type of arguments. Or somebody could be arguing with a Queen of Pentacles. I'm hearing some, a money-hungry baby mama. I don't know. But some of y'all, they, they was dealing with a high priestess and a baby mama of theirs. But this, this bad mother, I don't know. Three of Swords, Hangman, Harbuckin, Watcher. Investment. I feel like if 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 y'all was dealing with somebody, if y'all was dealing with a master that had two different females here, there's some type of argument going on because this Queen of Pentacles feel like 
Somebody owe her something. She got her hand out. Let me see. Let me get. Or, or this could be you. You could be coming out as the Queen of Pentacles. Because we got three of swords, hangman with the hermit. Somebody's watching somebody's investments or watching what they doing. How they working. What, what they doing here. Um. Somebody is money hungry. I'm here. I'm what you doing? What you doing? Where you at? Somebody asked a whole lot of questions. Give me some on this Queen of Pentacles. Ten of Swords. There was a betrayal here. The ultimate betrayal. This ultimate betrayal ended things. Give me something else on this Queen of Pentacles. For some of y'all, this queen, for some of y'all, this is a friend of yours. Whether this is a friend or a sister, this could be a sister or this man. Because they could be a part, now they, they could be a part of this rivalry here with the five of wands. They're a part of this, this clique, this, this group of motherfuckers that's ganging up on y'all or got something to say about something. It's a queen of pentacles. They could have invested, okay. They could have invested in money about y'all being watched. This could have broke whether you or your masculine or your divine feminine, wherever you see fit. This could have broke your heart, though. Because you could have found out whether your friend, your family member was in on this shit. You know? Like, they invested money for you to be watched here. For you to be stalked with the hermit. For you to be watched and investigated. For you to be stalked. This was the ultimate betrayal. And I feel like this person was doing magic, too. Yeah, they got their wand in the air with the page of pentacles. And who else, who look, and I, look, I'm here, Houdini. Who else over here with a page of pentacles? This broke ass motherfucker. Like, I, I'm telling you, they broke. They broke, they don't got no money. They did all this for money, though. I feel like they could be coming out as the queen of pentacles because that was the money. I'm here, mur murder on the brain, money on my mind. Like, this this person, they ain't getting no clue. They're like, oh, it's about money. Oh, I get some money. How much money you said I can get? Oh, so you telling me, yeah, you like, well, I'm here like $500, $300. Invest this little bit of money because the queen, the king, the, um, I'm here, the queen and king of pentacles. That's literally what I heard. I feel like that's y'all, I'm telling you. But with this page of pentacles here, you know, that's a little money. You know, that's, that's little. That's a couple hundred. And I feel like, they could have been like, they could have been, they could have been feeling like this though. They could have been like, oh yeah, I'm about to be like that. I'm about to be the queen of pentacles after this. I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm going shopping. I'm, I'm, girl, bye, girl. This could be a man too. Queen of pentacles could definitely be a man. Yeah, now I feel like you and your masculine, you and your feminine is the real king and queen of pentacles. All these other motherfuckers, they want to be. They want to. They want. This is all about money, y'all. This is so crazy because it's all about money. They invested a couple dollars with the magician. They could even did a little magic. You know, because they probably needed more people. You know, they, they needed a whole group. This is the group here. They needed a whole group to, to take down y'all. And some of y'all has to take down your feminine. It's to take down this, this, um, it's to, it's to take down you, Divine Family. You need a whole motherfucking group to take you down. And they still couldn't. But for some of y'all, this was the ultimate betrayal, though. Somebody is heartbroken, they sad about this, like, damn. This could even be somebody mama was in on it, taking her judgment. Look, judgment, what I say about that judgment? Judgment. I feel like y'all know, though. Y'all know who this was, y'all know... If you're still questioning it, then it's probably not the person that you're questioning. If you know for a fact, then it, it's that person. For some of y'all, it's a sister, though. It's a sister or a mama. Or it was somebody that was like a sister to you. I'm hearing close-knit. Close, I'm also hearing 
close-knit community, okay? Y'all could come from somewhere where everybody is close or um, everybody know each other, okay? Like a small town or something. I'm hearing small town girl in a crazy world. So whether you know, whether you was born in some type of small town, you went to the big city and maybe everybody knew each other, or you was in, uh, you know what, didn't I tell you go watch TV? Go watch TV, thank you. Or this is your, your masculine, maybe they from a, a small town um, and they went to a big city, or vice versa, they from a big city and went to a small town, okay? Keep hearing necromancy. Let me look. Let me see what that is. I'm not really sure. Yes, and that's crazy because when my phone dinged, that was confirmation. And that was my sister writing me. So tell me y'all it's a sister. Look, they don't want me to say that. Oh, shock is not. Hey, Siri. What is necromancy? Necromancy is the practice of magical sorcery involving communication with the dead by summoning their spirits as apparitions or visions, or by resurrection for the purpose of divination, imparting the means to foretell future events, discovery of hidden knowledge, brief burning a person to life, or to use the dead as a weapon. Do you want me to keep reading? Mm-hmm. Yup. There you go. There you go. Nope, thank you. Look, I blew on it. I don't know why I just blew. I don't know what that, I don't. <sighs> Ooh, that's the ancestors coming through. Look, with the world, I'm telling you, something's being completed, man. Something's being completed. Two of Cups. A cycle's being ended here. What is this two of pentacles? Ten of betrayal. This is the ten of swords. All right. So who is this? This is this. Somebody's juggling this betrayal. Now I feel like this is another motherfucker that could be juggling this betrayal. Juggling um. High priestess. This is somebody that's in two of cups too. Oh, for some of y'all, for some of y'all, your masculine was involved in this one for some time. I don't know, they could have been involved in this, because something's been illuminated. Yep, the devil, with the lover. I feel like it's two high priestess here. And I said that though. I said you are very intuitive as well. And so with with this coming out, I feel like only I feel like yo, you this could have been a betrayal. You could be dealing with a betrayal that your masculine could have done. Or your masculine is juggling this betrayal that was done to you. Okay. Or the or the parts that they could have had in something. Willingly or unwillingly. Okay. But it's definitely been I feel like the light was shined on the, this devil here. This, even I feel like even Stan, one of the as men, was obsessed with y'all connection with this lovers here. Because it's something that you guys are supposed to do. You guys are supposed to come together and do something here. I'm here to make music, make magic. You guys are supposed to be doing something beautiful here. Three of Wands. Yeah, look. Three of Wands with the strength. Okay, you guys are needed to um, stand your ground. And be defensive together. I feel like, yeah, I'm hearing it. I'm a movement by myself. But I'm a force when we're together. I am good all by myself. But baby, you, you make me better. You make me better. So I feel like once upon a time, you know, this person could have been in some type of malicious, you know, ways or whatever. They was bonded in some kind of way here. And I feel like they could be still juggling in their head with the, what they did to you. Or what they participated in. They probably shit. 
they probably, you know, I feel like for some of you guys, they knew what they were doing. For some of them, they didn't. Maybe they didn't know everything. I do feel like somebody could have lied to this master. They didn't know hand in hand, okay? Because, I mean, this, this person wouldn't be so much in their head, you know, if they would have knew exactly, you know, what was going on. Let me see. Look, what's the strength? The strength fell on my lap. I'm here. You're my sunflower. You're my sunflower. And remember, I said something about that sunflower she had. With the Ten of Wands here, this is releasing. Somebody seen something in a dream state. Whether you did, um, whether you did, um, Pisces. Or somebody, somebody seen something in a dream state. They're trying to release this and bring in balance. Okay, this is you. You maybe you seen this person doing some shit. This master could have also seen somebody doing something too. Um, Like these is all I feel like let me see something. Hold on. For some of you guys, this master was betrayed by this high priestess. Yeah. Him was they was somebody going to jail. Take it to the matrix. For faking something, they was faking something. Who's gonna make on this high priestess? Now somebody could be going to jail, or they could have went to jail for something they did to a high priestess. I think I like you. Look, we got what competition coming out in reverse? For some of you guys. There was a um, betrayal done, whether, I feel like there could have been a betrayal done to um, a high priestess, or a high priestess did the betrayal here. They could have, I feel like they lied to somebody to compete with somebody else. Oh, this could be your master. Maybe they, maybe somebody, you know, they felt like, oh, so I feel like this is two situations here. I feel like you could definitely be heartbroken because, you know, maybe this master was with somebody else or whatever they did with this high priestess here. Because I feel like you could definitely be a high priestess too. But I feel like there was this master um, feeling betrayed because this this high priestess never liked the film. They only wanted to compete with you. Because I don't know if you were some type of celebrity, you known out in the public, you know, or like your masculine could be. You, you, um, you're, you held in some type of high honor. This person wants to compete and be like you. Like, they really want to, comp they want to compete, but they want to be like you. Like, this one of those trying to be you but better than you type of shit. You know, they, they want to be like you, though. They really do. They want to be just like you when they grow up. Like, for real. But they call themselves competing. How are you competing when you're trying to act just like somebody? But how you gonna be me better than me? Motherfucker like, no, I can wear your skin better than you. You can do, wait, wait. You can do anything I can do. Wait, that fucking say, I can do anything better than you. Like, that type of shit. For some of you guys, they this could have been something about romance or sex. They feel like they could have sexed your... Your mask and better. They could even feel like you put this mask under some type of hypnosis, or they feel like you you had them wrapped around your finger, and so they feel like, oh yeah, let me do a little voodoo, let me blow sprinkle dinkle some shit in their face, and you know, fuck them real good or something, and I'm had them ripped around my finger. You ain't never had to do no magic. This was your partner. That's why that happened like that. You never did none of that shit. And if this is your mask is taking high resume, you never did none of that shit to your feminine. It's just the energy is like that because you guys are made for each other. 
You don't have to do that shit. That don't supposed to be in there. So I'm not helping you with that. Because it don't supposed to be in there. Put the pillow back on the bed. That's where the pillows go. On the bed. Stop putting that stuff in there. It don't go in there. You know my nerves, y'all. I'm gonna have patience. Um, <laughs> she really is because she already know this stuff. She's just doing stuff at this point. That's why it's time for time to lay down. What time is it? On down. Um, now I feel like all these people sitting around plotting on how y'all for y'all not to be together. We got Taurus and Aries. And the reason why it's coming off now. Something's transitioning here. Hold on. Aries is in reverse, but we got Taurus in the upright. Death, I mean, not death penalty. Uh, penitentiary jail bay is giving me almost as if it's turning upright. So something's going, somebody definitely is going to be going to jail about some type of betrayal. This could be spiritual court, or this could be like actual jail. They keep saying banquet. That's giving me almost upright. Maybe you didn't know that they were faking it. Okay, I had to just look at them and make sure and, and make sure a high time because I'm getting another message here with this same energy though. And I also feel like it's more people to this shit though. That's what's crazy. It's a lot of people. I, I feel like it's a lot of hush 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 money. And it's a lot of motherfuckers that's trying to bag out of shit because something not going through how it's supposed to be going through. It's getting illuminated. I think that light blue is coming out in a reverse. Yeah. It's getting like. There's definitely a transition here. I feel like at some point this um, there's a Taurus here and an Aries. Aries is coming out reverse. This could be one person, but I feel like King of Swords. At some point, this 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 King of Swords here. I don't know. Is this somebody else giving and receiving? There's a King of Swords here. There was some type of family partnership. For some of you guys, this is a baby father. Like if this is the divine feminine, this is a baby father. They could be an Aries or a Taurus, or they could be like Aries. Maybe you didn't know about an Aries or Aries and a Taurus knew each other or this could be one person. They came out together though. Who is this King of Swords here? I'm hearing that's just my baby daddy. That's just my baby daddy. This could be like an ex-husband. I'm hearing ex-spouse, a baby's father. But this person, I feel like this person was in a reverse. They, they trying to hide their hand on what they did or something. They was coming out in a reverse. This person's in a, almost in an upright. This could be literally separate. This could be literally something with just divine feminine. Maybe they didn't want your masculine. You to ever be in like a real partnership or in real love. But and I'm getting hot. I'm telling you. This is for somebody. It ain't going to be for all of y'all. Because it didn't come out 
at first I had to, you know, kind of, because I kept getting a feeling it's something else here. There was some type of giving and receiving. I feel like once upon a time, you could have been giving into something, receiving. There could also be, and I remember I said something about child support. There could be something about child support going on. You could have had a family with this person. Maybe y'all divorced, y'all broke up. And then with this two of cups, this person don't want you to be happy because the two of cups is giving almost in reverse. It's almost giving me like all these is in reverse. But I feel like this person could have, whether this is to come, they're going to be in the two of, I mean, the king of swords in reverse because you're getting into some new partnership. They're going to be trying to make it hard. Or this person has already been getting on your damn nerves and already been doing shit. This could be an ex-spouse, an ex-lover, or a baby daddy. Because I was just looking at the background and looking at the trees and shit on this car. And I was like, his tree's not moving. Something about him is still. He being strategic right now. He might not be doing a whole lot of shit. You see the cloud, the clouds. He's trying do he trying not to be recognized by something he doing or something he did. But he doing something. Cause this card almost turns in reverse right in front of me. It almost did this. I'm telling you, it almost. But it's like he's trying to be still. That's why he's coming out crossing. He's trying to be strategic. He's trying to hide his hand. But all these other cards, I don't know if you was giving into something. There was some type of giving and receiving. Just because, like I said, you could be taking care of a child and you're not getting something back. Or you're not getting something here. This person could have been being stingy. Maybe you finna start being stingy with something. You could have been trying to be fair and equal and balanced with something. Because this, with this ten of cups, this is family. But it's coming out in reverse. Like something's being broken up. Uh, something's no longer a happy home or somebody. I'm hearing un, un, uninvited guests, unwanted guests. And with the ten of cups. Yeah, this is giving me, because with the ten of cups in reverse, this is giving me um, non-committal. Maybe this person was cheating on you. They was doing something. Let's get clarification, y'all. We got make-believe fairy tales. And that's crazy because this is coming out and crossing, too. I feel like you're going to have a fairy tale ending, and everybody going to be mad about it. Everybody going to have something to say about what you got going on. Look, I'm telling you, they trying to sleep. Man. Give me something. Who's this king of swords? Look, hyperventilating, um, hyperventilating, anxiety attack, they crying and shit. Because they know you finna be in some type of, like, this. you could have been with this, with this person. And they were cheating on you and shit. And they was hurting you and doing stuff. And I feel like this person could have just vowed that you would never be, you could have broke up with them. You could have did something. You could have even told them, like, you gonna be with your soulmate. You waiting on your soulmate. You waiting on your twin flame, or you you gonna be happy. You could even this motherfucker could be mad because you celibate. Since the end of the day, try to push up on you, try to talk to you or whatever, and you told them no, and they like, you know, who who you over there fucking all? This could be somebody that's all in your business. They could be crying at night, hyperventilating. Yeah, bad hygiene, fucked up. Well, it really came out and fucked up priorities. So I feel like this person is, like I said, they don't take care of their child or they don't they don't do they don't do their responsibilities. It's something about their priorities is fucked up, out of order. Something's out of balance here. However they prioritize. They worry about other shit more than what they should be worried about, what's really important. What is this? This is this I feel like this was kind of hidden. Yeah. This person talking about, I will wait for you. That's coming out crossing too. But I feel like you could feel energetically that this person 
don't want you to move on or that they trying to wait for you. That they want to be with you or something. I feel like you could have waited for this person and they never gave you the equal, this equalness. The, um, this person could even stepped out on you. They, they could have did something real slimy. What's the Ten of Cups here? Wishing on the star. They want their family back. This is somebody who wants their family back. They could have Virgo in their chart, or you could be dealing with a damn Virgo, or your child is Virgo. They can have a resume. But this is somebody who, um, I'm telling you, y'all, it's right here. I never make up. This is somebody who they want their family back and shit. They boo hoo hoo crying and shit. But they 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 wasn't gonna commit or they didn't commit. They don't want you to be happy. They vow, yeah, some kind of hold over me. What competition? No. So this fell out over here, and then this goes over here. What competition? I'm telling you, they do not want you to be with your new partner. This is a jealous ass motherfucker. Some kind of hold over me. They they want this family. They still trying to hold on to this. For some of y'all, they feel like they could win you back. I ain't even gonna lie. They really do feel like they could win you back. But you already got some type of fairy. You got a fairy tale ending coming up, coming um out here for you. No, that's not yours. Go put it back. You in my room doing stuff. Investigate. I feel like you the one doing all this investigating. You looking into all this shit. But let's let's get into what they trying to do to stop this. Because I feel like this read going to be a little long, y'all. We're going to put this over here. Taurus and Aries. I'm hearing bull game. So I feel like for some of y'all, I'm telling y'all, it's a baby father that's an Aries. Or they a Taurus. Or um, for some of y'all, this is your twin flame. But I feel like if somebody here got kids with somebody, because it's a family here. Now, they could have, like, different placements. Maybe they, you know, take it however it resonates. Hold on. Determine all these people is determined to stop this. What is their next plan though? What is the move here? Okay, my star is telling me to look at that. Look, King of Cups. My star is telling me go in with my um my hidden oracle. Go in with the hidden oracle because I feel like they doing some voodoo voodoo. They doing some shit they ain't got no business doing. This card don't even go. This card go in there. But Aquarius could be significant. Or they could be doing this to you, Pisces. Or if your person's a Pisces, or it could be a Pisces that's doing this. Yeah, they monitoring somebody's devices here. What are they doing? Okay. We got um, Uranus, guy of God, father, father of the times, father of time. So I feel like they could be trying to stop, slow down the timing, okay, or when you guys come together. Now, I did do a reading about somebody trying to slow down the process of our awakening or slow down the process of you guys being awakened to this new union because they want to um, stop future events. So it's like... Slowing down, like, say for instance, if you're supposed to be in connection with your partner by now, y'all supposed to be having kids, y'all supposed to be living happily ever after. Motherfucker trying to slow that down, okay? And if, if you are already in the connection with your partner, that maybe they trying to slow down the process of y'all moving 
to the next level, okay? Because they they, they want to slow down to try to stop. It's like a process of elimination by slowing it down, though. What else? What else they, they doing? Yeah, they calling upon the omen, demon, okay? Greedy, uh, greed and money, the, the omen, omen and demon, okay? Um, they greedy and they like money, okay? They also enslave, um, they can enslave flesh. So it's like if you sign your soul, I'm hearing liver. So if you sign, sign your soul over to this particular deity, demon, um, and you don't fulfill the prophet or somebody could also be want to make you greedy, make this divine feminine greedy or make this divine master greedy, like greedy and hungry. Okay, now if you don't fulfill these prophecies or like you don't fulfill this this contract, whatever you sign with them, they will they can embody your flesh. They will put you in some type of um uh, uh, enslavement. I'm here um uh, property of the state. So that's giving me jail. Shit. We already said somebody over here going to jail. What are they determined to do? Somebody needs to get them a prayer box, okay? You could be stressing out about this. You could be thinking a lot about this, okay? Do your research, okay? Do your research and get you a prayer box. I feel like the divine is here. You just need to give it to the divine, okay? Release um, all your worries and stress. Because I feel like something's happening anyways. They could be doing whatever the fuck they want to do, really. I just want to update y'all on... What exactly is they're doing so that you know what to look for? Yeah. And we got protection, love, happiness, and money spells. So for some of you guys, it's okay to do you protect. I mean, definitely do meditate on it. If you don't want to take my word for it, meditate on it. Okay, definitely do look into, uh, you know, ask for discernment. Whether or not you, you, you should go ahead and do you some spells. But I feel like it's okay because... You, you, and it's coming out, it's almost giving me, almost as if it's, leave that alone and close that curtain. It's almost giving me as if it's turning in the reverse. Because I feel like you might not know this, you might feel like it's bad. Yeah, Erebus, we got Erebus, darkness and shadow. I feel like it's okay though, because for some of you guys, you're balancing your light and your dark. So, you, you, it's okay. But definitely do meditate on it, and you can ask for your own permission, which is, I mean, understandable, you know. Don't don't just never take nobody's word for it, but, you know. Yeah, look, signs. So I feel like you definitely need to pay, pay attention to the signs and synchronicities that happen all around you at this time. Okay, we got, um... Okay, I don't know how to say the name, and I don't want to say it wrong. Let... Leptis, Leptis, God of mortal life, okay? Um, they were a Tyson. They were a Titan. So they was one of Zeus's brothers. I feel like you could be, something is, something about living forever, okay? So some of you guys, you need to take care of your body so you and, and keep your spirits high, okay? Yeah, we got Archangel Michael. Well, yeah, Archangel Michael coming out in the reverse. You don't see this, okay? Yeah, led the army against the devil, the protector, okay? The, uh, Archangel Michael does give second chances here, okay? Uh, but it's coming out in the reverse. I feel like somebody could have been afraid about dying, okay? Maybe somebody was afraid about dying. Or, you know, for some of you guys, I, I do feel like your master could have dealt with something. Or, Archangel, Archangel Joseph, Joseph, I mean, um, Joseph, Joseph, Hale, okay, beauty and wisdom, um, the goddess of watching. So, God, God of let me see, what is this though? God of mortal life. What is that about? For some of you guys, who is said? Okay, let me see. Somebody can be passing away. Or somebody did pass away. Some of y'all, your masculine, um, is uh, they moving into.
Bahama waters with you. Oh no. Somebody could have been trying to wish death on now. Let's go ahead and get that out. Okay, with the ace of cups. Okay, thank you for that confirmation, high power. Now, for some of you guys, uh, they tried to wish death on your masculine here. Uh, they could have did something where they made them sick or they did something here. There was some type of heartbreak, but I feel like somebody, yeah, they was heartbroken because somebody was moving into calmer waters with this empress here. Um, but I feel like, I feel like, you know, maybe somebody is asking for, that's why Archangel Michael is coming out in the reverse here. Archangel Michael stepped in and shielded something. Okay, so this is in the upper, I feel like you might not know this, that Archangel Michael helped you along with something here. Because for some of you guys, they were trying to kill you, end you out. I, they were doing this slick though. I don't know if they was making somebody sick, okay? Putting something in somebody's food, a cancer could be involved, or are they trying to get them some type of deadly disease? I'm hearing uncurable disease. Yeah. For some of y'all, your masculine did catch this. I'm also here contagious. They could have got real sick. For some of y'all, they did get this shit. But I feel like something's being taken care of. Something's being cured. Because with the three of swords, that, that's heartbreak. But somebody's moving into common waters with their interest here. And somebody was also judged because somebody's moving into common waters. That's the whole reason of doing this shit. Okay? These people are determined, though. They are still doing shit in the background, but I feel like you're, you're needing to release it and get you a prayer box and don't even worry about it because you made it this far. So it's nothing that they can really do. It's already happening. It's already here. And I feel like they could also be jealous because this is my mask is going to come into some money. And they're going to be the king of pentacles. And when they do, they moving forward with their queen of, they, they, I'm going to say queen of wands. They moving forward with their empress. Confirmation. They moving forward with their empress. Yeah. They moving into some waters. Y'all might literally be moving across water, you know. They could be children involved. Or if not, you're going to have some children here. And I feel like both of y'all been through separate different occasions where motherfuckers tried to come up against y'all and hurt y'all and, you know, be conniving. Some of them was doing magic. Not everybody was doing magic, but some of them was actually doing voodoo magic, invested in magic. Some of them was just, like, causing chaos, conflict, okay, not doing their responsibilities or, you know, trying to stop you from having the love of your life, okay? But either way it go, you definitely will be moving forward, okay? I'm here, Chris Brown. Then again, you know I want another round, another round, another round. You know I want another round, another round, another round. I do apologize if this reading was a little bit longer. But, you know, we got it all out there, Pisces. So, definitely take it, have a resume. I really do hope this video, Noel, can you go on with that? Whatever you shaking, stop. I really do hope this video resonates with you guys. I really do hope this video helps you guys. I love you guys, and I just want you guys to have the best, okay? You know, like, be happy, you know, sending, sending prayers and good luck and wisdom and blessings, you know, just sending love and light, okay? Because this shit is deep. But I want you guys to definitely stay prayed up, stay stress free, and I will definitely catch you in the next one. Send another light till next time. Bye. Bye.